So do you wish you could use your Sony ZV-1 or any other Sony camera as a webcam for your virtual meetings or your video tutorials? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how. Hey there, welcome to the video. I'm Mark Brown from Editor's Keys. Now, if you want to improve your videos, consider subscribing to the channel because we've got a ton of videos all about that. So do you have a MacBook Pro or PC and you're just fed up of this terrible video quality coming from the built-in webcam? Well, you can easily up your video quality just like this with a couple of steps. So let me show you how. So this is actually very simple to do. All you need is a video capture card. Now, video capture cards have often been very expensive in the past, but I found this one for under $20, which will do the job perfectly. So all you need is this. I'll put a link in the description below if you want to check this one out and then all you need is an HDMI cable to connect your capture card to your camera so I'll also put a link in the description below so let me show you how you plug this in and how this works with your Mac or PC so the first thing you'll need to do is plug in your video capture card to your computer and your camera. So I'm using the micro HDMI cable to plug this into the Sony ZV-1. And then once this is all connected, we can simply plug it into the side of any Mac or PC. And then once you're within your Mac, you'll notice you now have the option for a USB camera instantly in all of your favorite programs. There's actually no extra software or downloads required. Now, one thing I have noticed is that you can only get 1080p out of this card, but you know what? That's pretty perfect for streaming. I definitely wouldn't want the bandwidth of 4K on a video call anyway. So there you go, that is it. It's super simple, isn't it? Just using a piece of kit for under $30, you can turn any camera into the perfect webcam for your video calls or your video tutorials. So I hope that's helped. And if you've got any questions about this or if you wanna see us do any more tests, leave us a comment in the comment section below and we'll get back to you. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.